everybody welcome to day one of my gallon a day journey so I busted out my big old water bottle and every morning I go to the gas station and get a Diet Mountain Dew this morning I'm getting a Diet Mountain Dew and I'm gonna fill this puppy up to the top I have to drink two of these a day so hopefully I can get this one done by like three o'clock We'll see. But you guys secured the goods and hey love, thank you for coming. I got you something. Thank you for coming. He keeps me company every morning. Good boy. I am in my guest bedroom working in here today and I'm about to take my first sip. So here we go. Yay, it got me down to still nothing. But yay. All right, I'll catch up with you guys in a little bit. All right, you guys, I have finished this puppy and it's time to refill it. So let's do that. All right, it is filled up again. Time to get drinking. All right, you guys, I'm taking my last few sips for the night. You can see there's just a little bit in there. Done! Day one is complete and I will see you guys tomorrow for day two. Two and I have secured the goods. So let's get this day going. All right vlog, I just got off work and I thought I would let you all know that I pee 30,000 times a day. It's not very helpful because I work in an elementary school, so I can't be doing that. It's like obnoxious the amount of times I have to leave students in the classroom. Like, ridiculous. So that's how this is going. So I'm gonna go because I have to pee right now, but the amount of times that I have to go to the bathroom is ridiculous. All right, guys, I am about to be on my way to the gym, but I just wanted to hop on and talk to you about the water class because I don't even know what day I'm on, but I've been crushing it. It's really not that hard to get in a gallon of water a day. So I've, I'm one, I'm one 16 ounce bottle away right now from getting in a gallon of water. And I'm just now headed to the gym and I still haven't had dinner. So it's definitely doable. And if it actually has all of the benefits that everybody says it does, highly recommend all of you to try this out because it's really not that hard and like the amount of effort that it takes is totally worth it. So I would definitely try it out if I were you. Just, just give it a try. There's nothing that water can do to hurt you. Today is the last day of my water challenge. So I'm at work, I've gotta finish this one and then another one I haven't started yet. But I'm so excited for this to be done because I'm tired of peeing every hour. But yeah, I thought I would do an extra good job of vlogging today because I really haven't vlogged much this challenge and that's not good. All right, it is lunchtime. This is my first drink of the day. Yay, I'm at almost, I'm almost at 7 a.m. guys, and it's like 11. Okay guys, lunch is over, and I made it to 5 p.m. So guys, see, the water challenge is not that hard. It's really not. You should try it. All right guys, my water challenge is done. I have completed it, and Here's the results. So I started this challenge at 180, 188.6. If I'm wrong, then I'll put it on the screen to let you know I'm wrong. And I ended the challenge at 187.6. So I lost a full pound, which I am very impressed with. Like that's a lot of weight to lose in just a week. So definitely happy about that and I didn't take it before and after so those are my physical results so 
let's talk about my like mental or like health results. I got more steps in the day because I went to the bathroom more. So yay for that, but also boo for that because it was really annoying. Um, I started trying to outsmart myself and I would not drink all the way up until lunch. Chug the water, <laughs> like the water bottle at lunch. I found myself drinking less canned drinks. So with dinner, I might have like a Diet Sunkiss or a Diet Big Red or a Zevia, just something that's like carbonated and bubbly because I enjoy that type of stuff. But with the water fast, I didn't really do that. And yay, because one, that saves me money. Two, it's probably healthier for me. So that was really awesome. I felt like my body, I just felt better. Like I didn't feel like I was really heavy and weighed down. Like I was, I was pretty active and I didn't mind being overly active. So like constantly having to move around. Like if I needed to get up off the couch, I didn't mind to just jump up and do it. I wasn't like sluggish. That's a good word. I didn't feel sluggish really during this water challenge. So that's awesome. Would I do it again? Um, no, I wouldn't because of how much of an inconvenience it was to be using the bathroom all the time, but I will definitely be drinking more water during the day. So those are my final thoughts. Thank you guys so much for clicking on this video. And if you made it this far, you are awesome. And I really appreciate you watching my channel. Like, honestly, I, I do really appreciate it. Um, go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already and ding the bell. That way when I upload, you will know instantly because YouTube will send you a notification. Um, and also if you want to leave a comment, ask me some questions, let me know you enjoyed the video, literally whatever you want to say. I appreciate all the comments I get. So that is it for today and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!